Hello and welcome back to our channel Lady T. My name is Natalie and we are going to continue here with Bear and Breakfast. Uh, yes, that's where we want to go. Five guests have checked in because there was the motel was just completely empty. I think that they should be staying for two days so that we don't have a problem. We don't have to put anyone in until after that. Okay, three of them leave tomorrow. What? Hey, you. Okay, so there are three more in there right now. That's a good thing. Now we're going to see if we can find some more trashes because we're really low on trash. Okay, then there's nothing here yet. Where would we buy eggs? Maybe with the little guy over here? It would make sense, wouldn't it? Yes! Haha! -ha. I'm broke. I'm broke! Already. It's just a shame. We've gone on to become lazy bears. All three of them leave tomorrow. Nice! Did that help with the prestige? Of course it didn't. Why would it? E? Why would it? Oh yeah, but we can't finish building it. Always forget that. Eh. Can we make a dinchy... Dinchy one? So that at least for now we can put it down. That we can always change it up. We don't have enough money. This is ridiculous. Ridiculous. <sighs> Seriously, sometimes. Well, now I guess they're going to hate it here because they can't even poop or shite. There's not a whole darn lot that I can do about it. I wish that we could sell some stuff. Because there's definitely stuff that I don't need right now. Got something for me back there? Yep, fresh out of the kitchen. Oh, salty, savory, creamy, delicious. It tastes like I'm about to do something useful. You make a mean egg dippy, big boy. Thanks, I didn't lay it, only cooked it. We used to get egg dippy maybe once a year of that. My poor ma, I don't blame her. She did the best she could. We were 12 brothers and she had to carry us all on her back. Literally. And we were all little dumbasses too, driving her up the wall. Oh man, I don't think my mom could have handled more than one hang. Ah, I remember one time my two older brothers and I got up in the middle of the night to steal the pudding. And we accidentally dropped the whole ball from the third floor. I swear her mouth was spouting fire. I thought I was for sure dying that night. I wasn't allowed out of the hole for three days straight. Uh, Yeah, that wasn't even the longest I got put in the hole. Did she ever put you someplace nice when you did something good? Like uh, a shelf up high somewhere? What? No, that's dumb. Besides, I don't remember doing something good. Like ever. 
It was like we were 12 devils put on this earth to torment her. And boy, were we good at it. I don't know. I remember doing a lot of dumb things, but I don't think we ever had a hole. Yeah? Well, how did you get punished? Forced to eat dish soap? The old stick over the paw? I hated that one. She usually sat down with me and told me what I did wrong. I usually felt bad enough to apologize and never do it again. Oh. I see. That's dumb. Hey, you know what? When you're done scavenging, I think I could use some help with the humans. Oh? Yeah, see I'm not a big people bear and I was thinking I needed someone with some heart. Some zing. Hmm. And, and don't get me wrong, you have a lot of stinky energy. Damn right. But maybe that's exactly what I need from someone running my conscious tent. Do you... Do you mean that? Of course, I could use someone scaring some mustaches off a few folks for a fair price. Well, that's one of the least dumb things you've said today, Hank. Listen, if I come and help you, I'll need my own little table with my own little chair. That's fine. Always the undeniable people person cuts head off at his services as a concierge. All he asked for was a little stand through which he could take care of business, of course. A perfect position for such a uh, charming individual. Very charming. Deal! Okay, that's great. So great, I'm excited. This is awesome. You're awesome. I'm complimenting. Thanks, Hank. <gasps> now we just have to put you guys as offer to come work for you. His specialty is um, meeting and greeting people. You've learned the blueprint for guest stand, now crafted at any workbench. Place guest stand anywhere. Anywhere near resort to unlock a services for that area. You can turn on guest services through the cabin management screen. Guests, guests will automatically accept new guests to any bedroom she indicates, saving you the need to do it many- oh. However, guests won't be as good as you as matching bedrooms to guests needs, so choose which room she asks him to manage carefully. Every bedroom guest manages for cost a fixed number of coins per day. If you run out of coins, the service will stop automatically and you will need to turn it back on yourself. Where am I? Likewise, if you edit the staff item of the room, it affects the service will stop and will need to be turned on manually. Okay. But that helps. That really, really, really helps. We're still low on treasures. Doesn't look the best, but hey, it works. Okay. Prestige level is up to level 4. The job is complete. And we still have more to do. Build one level, three bedroom and timber crossing, and house plus two guests with the bumper trade. Trade. I can't do anything here now. Do we even have a new bed for that? Not yet. I will have to make the small bed. Tiny, tiny bed. This one. And that will be that bedroom. the pamper trade. Oh, the guests have to have the pamper trade. That makes sense. And I still don't think that they expected me to have three bedrooms in there. What do you do? You have more trash? It would be nice if you could use you for trash. That you can just put stuff in there and make trash out of it. So that you have more trash. Because I really don't have enough trash. Fly the spirits don't know how good they have it. No one bothering them about not flying. I'm literally walking here. It would be nice if you guys helped out, you know.
Mama? Still my bedroom. Where's Mama's bedroom then? She got me a level 3 bed. Level 2. My Mama did well. You'll stay up all night watching movies again. Something about the dog named Marley. So now I fell asleep all for through. With the rest of my mom. What about a review so far? Get four and a three and a half. Well, that's better than I expected. So that's a good thing. And hopefully Gus took care of this as the game promised us that he would. Leaves tomorrow, leaves tomorrow, leaves tomorrow. Handled by Steph, so it is done. Restore res decoration is 101, so that's really good. Good. This is running itself now. Money wise, we're doing really good. We could have a little dining area. Do you have to have a kitchen too? And then I have to take a look at that, and I'm not really in the mood for that. Maybe I should turn uh, gas off so that I can actually complete that thing. But for now I kind of like having the hands off approach. Oh, this is ready. Haha. -ha. We can at least check that off. And then move on to the next task with that. Making some progress again. I just still wish that you would get some treasures from this as well. This is sad. The job is complete. Congratulations, you are one step uh, forward for escaping mediocrity, but you're not there yet. Build two level one buff. <laughs> I already had one. A trinket that will help you carry more things. Would you like to accept? Yes. I had another bedroom. Bathroom. Uh, yeah, the only thing we didn't have a level two of. Uh, where, where is it? Right here. We didn't have two of those. Well, luckily I didn't build uh, another... What was it called? Another bedroom yet. I had one. I had one. There we go. And it's level 2, it's level 2. Disgusting looters. 
make this place look nice. What do you do? Oh, we're just going to crank it up. Uh, free leave tomorrow. Great, we have more treasures for the other place. Yes, we are done with that. Your global rating is no longer junk. Guess we'll now have higher expectations for this location or for more money in return. Find it in your, a fanny pack. There's more to be done, of course there is. Build three level three bedrooms. I think I've already done that. Yeah. Job is complete. Uh, feel like you need notification. There's no time for that. Keep it up. Raise the prestige to level 4. Haven't we already done that? Yes, we have. Congratulations, Pompeyas is always in need of skilled entrepreneurs. We hope that one day you could become one. <laughs> Guess we'll now have higher expectations. No, no, no. Build one level 3 bathrooms. We don't have that ability yet, but we will get there. And we're going to get something else for one of the for a couple of the rooms. So that we can have some more nice stuff in there. Terrarium. So we can spruce up the other rooms a little bit. Today's episode is a little slow because we're not entering new areas, we're just trying to keep everything up to snuff and repairing some stuff, uh, decorating some stuff, getting it to be a little bit prettier. And that's about it. That's not a whole lot of stuff we have to do. go a little more cleanliness wait not enough hygiene not enough food quantity or quality enough food oh maybe they want a higher level the entire resort's kind of cheap i i know Room is not decorated enough, not enough height, not enough food quantity or quality. Understood. Completely understand. Uh, we can get some more food with us. Some more food. There you go. Oh. I can't really do anything for you guys. I mean, food is what it is. I'm trying to keep everything nice, but we can't. So you can be angry all you want, but be angry at management. One level three bathrooms. We don't have that ability yet. Okay, what we're going to do is keep Gus off uh, for the next for Timber Crossing so that we can at least have this done. Edit, turn off, save changes. If tomorrow, can I do? Yes. Because we need guys like you. Ok, 
Okay. Because what do we need? Uh, host two more guests with the fan portrait. I think that we just accepted those. We'll see. Did I already put new guests in highlight? I don't think I did. Maybe I did. Maybe I've done so. I don't know. Go and see. Quickly check that. I get that people don't really like this resort. We are doing the best that we can. This is not all darn lot, but it is something. Everything is in tip-top shape. Room is not comfortable enough. Excuse you! This is a level 3 bedroom. Okay, so some guests want better beds. Fuck you. Uh, so maybe... Oh, that's why probably the guests don't know that there is a bathroom because it's not close enough in the other hotel. We'll fix that next episode. Thank you so much for watching. I'm going to do a lot more in the next episode. Have a lovely day. Goodbye.